Who? What's up, Phaser? Wolfie Jobs Donuts here. One of the actual games directors who ain't posted on this for a while because I've been posting to other, I guess, uh, network site, not network sites, like FMJ e etc. Yeah. But um, yeah, this is a CTF on bootleg. It's a just a pickup scrim. Uh, a pickup scrim is pretty much where you know, like how like some of your mates go play football or soccer or baseball or rugby or whatever like you just have a little fun game like just you still practice and you still like try a little bit you still try obviously but uh yeah it's kind of like them it's basically just a practice but with a bunch of people random people but yeah usually i play the obj role and today i kind of played the uh on this gameplay a support slash um i guess support slash slayer type because you know, I've been kind of using this class a lot in S&D and playing a lot of search recently because it's one of my favourite game modes. And, um, yeah, so I just thought I would put, put this up there. And um, also, one thing I do enjoy about uh, this map in general is... This is just bullshit. Look at that. Look. But um, one thing I do enjoy about this map for the whole, in, I guess, the thing... It's a very nice looking map. Like, everything's very nicely structured compared to other maps in the Call of Duty series. For example, Outpost. I hated map. Like, they should really, they really need to work on the maps like they did in Black Ops or Black Ops 2, in my opinion, because pretty much they all are very, these ones are all very weird for competitive play because they're not very well structured for a very good competitive map. It needs to be structured. Like, let's say a summit for example from black ops if you've ever played it um the top part of it where pretty much you overlook bdom or the middle of the map is one of the greatest I guess, points to go because pretty much it's a choke point where you can watch all three sides and if you if you can slay you can hold it up there and this is a very fucking smart play by me as you can see i jump back pre-fire him so he can run away get shot and then take it straight so i see people pushing down street so that was a very good play by me, but um, one thing that I really noticed when I tried to play AR, I do a lot of things wrong, but I try to pull flags and push up really far. I don't know why I did this, but uh, it's pretty much probably because of my OBJ or support, OBJ slash support uh, mentality, where I'm just like, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna just quickly go up and get them, okay? And then I end up just pooping pretty much. But uh, yeah, I've been getting into uh, PC gaming a lot recently with a couple of other phaser directors. Uh, big shout out Minecraft Munchies, uh, Chase, Mind Clan, and obviously Mr. Gization and Trevor. You Irish bastard. <laughs> nah, I'm only joking, Trevor. I love you. Kind of. Um, but yeah, so I've been doing a lot of PC gaming recently and I've been trying to get more. I'm going to try and get a COD4 Pro mod started again, because I was pretty good at that when it came to it. But uh, yeah, this is only going to be the first half, so I can keep it fresh and boring. And there, that was a dumb move by me, because I knew I couldn't get it. But pretty, if you guys not ever like play competitive, pretty much a Slayer is just pretty much goes around the main points of the map and gets kills. I didn't really do it that well, because I, well, I did do it quite well in my opinion, because I kept trying to push middle. And um, yeah, if you guys don't know, competitive, competitive is pretty much how you about you, how about you play, not the score. Well, it kind of is. Like if you're dropping like really bad, like five and like twenty, you're doing bad. But it's kind of like this way. If I went nine and nine, nine and nine as the OBJ player, that's pretty good. No, ten and ten. Let's say that's no, a bit stupid actually. Let's say nineteen and twenty-one. That is still pretty good, long as I've capped four flag. But on this, I've kind of need to be. Uh, slaying more than anything so i'm pretty much trying to get this free piece which i believe i don't even get because i pre-fired it but um yeah the video is coming to a close now um part two will be uploaded after this one hopefully when i get a new series uh, a new thing coming and it's a very bad fail there for me I, I i'm so used to using ump and uh, some machine guns i don't know how to play with ar but um yeah it's coming up to a close the first round we win 1-0 and yeah pretty much also I don't know why I went up decided to go up here as an AR because pretty much this is the bad side and look at that shot bad and then Mr. Dan going a little fucker Irish legend he is but um yeah also there's a giveaway on my channel if you want to come 
um, hop over for a Borderlands giveaway with Game of the Year edition. Uh, come on, submit. It's on my latest video, and uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll hopefully see you in part two. And remember, guys, stay classy.